Okay, so today we're going to be talking about how you can find the different parts for a stealth vest. Really, really easy in the DMZ. Stuff that you're going to need is a game console, encrypted USB, and a comic book. And there's a couple locations that I like to go to find these really quick. And I'm going to try and get that helicopter so that I can fly to the different areas and show you guys what I'm talking about. But before we get over there, there's actually the first place I like to loot, right here. These little banks. And I'd show you the outside, but I'm getting shot by bots. But I've covered these banks quite a bit. They are good for money, they're good for the encrypted USBs, and sometimes you can find comic books in here. But in each of these rooms, there's one or two computers. Sometimes you can find gold bars. Another gold bar. Yeah, there's a lot of gold bars in here. So really quick, I'll show you where they are on the map. You have one here, in Seraph Bay. You have one over here in Sawa. You have one up here, in Saeed. So there's three. Four is over here, north of airport. And then you have two over in the city. You have one where this eliminate, or no, north of that. Right here. And then you have one right over here. And they're all set up the same. So I'm not going to cover the other ones if I end up going to them. Just kind of showing you. The inside, there's an encrypted USB. A lot of people running around. Some classified docs. Don't want to stay here too long. I think there might be people coming here. So you've seen the bank, now we're going to go to a couple locations that I like to get comic books and game consoles at. These little shops that have a lot of shelves, you're more likely to find a game console on them. And we're not going to find one here. But also in this, these little back rooms, so there's a computer. This is the one that I am at right now. They kind of look like that. There's a couple different spot, uh, spots for them. So there's one over here. There's a couple little ones over here north of the airport. This is a really good spot. And then you have some over here in city spread throughout. There's one up here. So those are all these different areas that you can find stores like this. And we're going to hit a couple because I'm going to be looking to try and find a game console. You can find game consoles and a bunch of other stuff in uh, shopping center. Yeah, see, there's police. There's that little store just like the one that I uh, came from. And then you got mall right here. Denied area. Stay sharp. Somebody's been here, I think. Hello, good sir. Hello. You guys, uh, you guys looting here? If so, I'll leave. We are. Right. For? Uh, just looking for a game console. Ultra One, you've got hostile reinforcements incoming. Hostile UIV in the air. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, you can loot through there. I'm not going to because there is an enemy team there. You do have to keep that in mind if you don't want to encounter enemy teams. Most likely they're going to be looting or have looted in the mall, but it is a possibility to go there and loot. So we're just going to move on. I don't know if they're going to be friendly or not. I'm not going to risk it. Alright, so here's another store that has a bunch of shelves. Video cassette. And you really need to look down the rows because you can find a bunch of stuff. Plates and comic books. Look at all this stuff. Okay. Also really good if you're looking to do passives to come to these little stores. We have one more over here on the other side of this building. 
And I'll show you on the map again when I get over here. This is going to look familiar because we were just over in a building like this on the other side of the map. Uh, there's this comic book. No game console this time. Another comic book. Okay, so really quick. North of airport. It's this building and this building for game consoles. There's two buildings I'd really like to loot right next to each other, but I don't know if I'm going to if this LTV is still here. Yeah, there's still a team fighting. You can see him down there. I'm not gonna mess with that. The great thing with having multiple spots to loot is you can decide, hey, this area is hot, I'm not gonna go there. I'm gonna go somewhere else. Now we're gonna try this building here, like I was telling you guys. I'll show you on the map once I get landed. I will say this one's a little dangerous, just because you have the television station there, you have high-rise over here, so be careful going here. And this little building, there's a couple of these. They have computers upstairs that you can check. I'll show you the location of this on the map. I also apologize if I'm talking fast. There's a lot going on, so I'm trying to get everything uh, for you guys, information-wise. Yeah, just look through the shelves. Not seeing anything right now. Just plates. All right, we're gonna get out of here. Let's check in these back rooms. There's shelves in the back rooms also. See, look at all these plates. You really don't need to buy plates if you go to these locations either. Just because you'll have a whole bunch. Really quick. So this is right here. This building is good for game consoles. And then you have computers here, computers here, computers here. So this is another good area to check to get stealth vest going. There's also computers in uh, TV, but I don't know if I would even worry about going to TV. There's so few. Don't really want to get involved. Probably not a good idea with having no three plate. A lot of people dying. Been looted. There's a game console. Somebody's nearby. Alright, at this point, I'm not going to engage. I'm going to fall back. I'm going to fall back and get my helicopter and uh, get my stealth. And then I might come back here. We have a buy station nowhere. South. And there's the stealth. I do need a medium bag. To get the ability to make the stealth plate carrier, you will need to go into Koshai and kill the sniper. It's really not that big of a deal. Uh, if you, It's even possible to do it solo. Just go in with the broadside with dragon breath rounds and you can kill Rhino really quick. Sniper, you can even kind of take your time on with, uh, with that. But if you do need help killing the sniper, killing Rhino, every Friday I do playing with viewers and I can help you do this. So if you need help and you're seeing this video, stop by the stream Fridays. 
and I will help you out.